Hi everyone, in this video, let us take a quick look over the Nokia 3310. Yes, the new Nokia one which was released in 2017 and which is named not just Nokia 3310 but Nokia 3310DS. So without any further ado, let's take a quick look at the phone. Subscribe to my YouTube channel like this and click on the bell icon like this to never miss a new video. So guys, this is the new Nokia 3310DS. It looks a pretty nice phone from the outside. As you can see here is the dial pad, here are a few navigation buttons. This is the screen and the screen has a very smooth glass over it. As my thumb is rolling over it I can feel it here there is a Nokia logo and a receiver the phone has a matte finish all over the plastic body yes the body is plastic no special metals and uh, as you can see this is a headphone jack yes there is a headphone jack on this phone so nice of Nokia to keep that on this side there is nothing on this side also there is nothing and on the top we have a micro USB very weird for a phone to charge from the top have a USB on the top here there is a 2.0 megapixel um, rear camera with a flash that can be used as a dot and here is a primary speaker the primary speaker is actually really loud I will show you how loud it is but first let us boot the phone up and see it from the software side it has a pretty cute startup sound. Hear it. Okay, that was the startup sound. And we also have one cool feature of having a welcome note. As you can see, I had set all dimensions tech as the welcome note. Okay. So this is the screen of the phone. We can just press this button to go to the menu and here we have all our apps. And here is a nice little go to menu. If we just uh, press it then we can see every single menu, every single feature of this phone. Well I have actually enabled all of them to be in the menu. By default there are only 5-6 items in this menu. But you can add them, organize them in any way and choose whichever ones you want. It is not like iPhone control center where some objects are fixed and you don't have the ability to fully customize it. This is different. Also, if we now press this button, then it adds the shows the call history and it's saying something to me. No calls yet. Why not dial a friend and say hi? Okay, I will I will call someone later on and uh, Pressing this button will bring some quick menu here, which uh, Allows me to adjust volume turn Bluetooth on or off and here is even an option to turn the phone off if I press ok now Then the phone will switch off now I can even lock the phone from here just press this button and the phone is locked Now on, to unlock the phone simply press this button again and phone is unlock unlocked now going to the menu there is everything that you can expect from a typical feature phone call log contacts photos internet yes there is an internet browser in this phone but the problem is that this phone is only 2g so therefore web pages will take 15 minutes 10 to 15 minutes to load depending on your area 2g isn't that fast we have messaging also we have a very nice snake game that is not the traditional snake game which you used to play on old uh, feature phones this one is different i will show you some gameplay after later on and one more unique thing is that it has a mobile store from which we can download apps currently i don't have internet on this so there is a problem let me just go home show you some another app there are my apps here we can see all the apps that we have downloaded. Currently I haven't downloaded any app. Then uh, we have camera. The camera on this phone is actually pretty decent considering the price. It's a nice 2 megapixel sensor. 
I will click a photo of this surrounding and will show it to you. It's just fast actually in taking photos. Actually, it takes time to save photos. See, the photo quality looks good. Now, let me show you some of the photos that I had captured. Now, see this. This is my photo without flash. And this is with flash. Actually, there is no significant difference in daylight with using flash. And <laughs> there are photo effects. So, I have just made my hand look negative by color and this is just the one photo that I took now let's go home again now on uh, every phone quick look video on this channel I tell people all the ringtones and the type of calling interface it has so we have a lot of ringtones I'm just going to show you some of my favorites so beep once is uh, just uh, basic that's nothing and doesn't even seem like a ringtone and uh, there is this typical nokia tune but, but actually it is a little bit modernized which is great then the coconut one is a good ringtone destiny is also not bad Then there is this nocturnal ringtone and these ringtones are all boring but this urgent ringtone is what I am going to keep because I just don't want anything fancy to ring on my phone when someone is calling me a simple ringtone is better for me so it's set now and now let us talk about the calling interface whenever a call comes to the phone it appears like this so guys did you get an idea how loud the speaker was actually I had set it to the maximum volume it is very loud I can actually hear it in my entire house that's so loud oh my god so okay guys that's pretty much it for this quick look at the nokia 3310 or 3310 whatever you might call thank you for watching uh, goodbye see you in the next one